drug eluting stents better than bare metal stents for the treatment of left main coronary artery disease. The left main coronary artery disease is characterized by atherosclerosis in the epicardial coronary arteries. It is often accompanied by a series of complications such as instant resinosis for the treatment of percutaneous coronary intervention. Bare metal stents is a stent without a coating or covering and is a mesh like a tube of thin wire. Drug eluting stents is a peripheral or coronary stent placed into narrowed, diseased peripheral or coronary arteries that slowly release a drug to block cell proliferation. The primary objective of the study was to compare the efficacy of the drug eluting stents and bare metal stents for the treatment of left main coronary artery. The patients who had clinical symptoms and signs of myocardial ischemia and angiographically documented for unprotected long main coronary arteries lesions were included in the study. Patients with cardiogenic shock, contraindications to aspirin or clopidogrel therapy or planned upcoming non-cardiac surgery were excluded from the study. The study included 1,159 consecutive patients who underwent percutaneous coronary intervention for left main coronary artery disease. In that, 1,020 underwent drug eluting stents implantation and 139 underwent bare metal stents implantation. The continuous variables were expressed as the mean standard deviation and compared between groups using the t-test. The categorical data was expressed as percentages and compared between groups using the chi-square or Fisher's exact tests. The cumulative incidence of the events was calculated using the kaplan mayi oro method and the estimated curves were compared using log rank test. A glycoprotein 2b or 3a inhibitor was administered. Then the location and the length of the stent was selected. The side branch stent was placed with small protrusion into the main vessel or a balloon in the main vessel and was simultaneously dilated when the side branch stent was deployed. After the stent implantation, routinely high pressure dilatation was performed and it also includes final kissing balloon dilatation after distal left main coronary artery disease, bifurcation stenting. Aspirin and clopidogrel were administered before the surgery and continued. Clopidogrel, 75 mg per day was continued as a maintenance dose for 3 to 6 months after bare metal stents transplantation and 12 to 24 months after drug eluting stents implantation. Aspirin, 300 mg per day was continued for 1 month. The clinical outcome of the study was obtained after 5 years. The graph shows the variation between bare metal stent and drug eluting stent. The major adverse cardiac event, myocardial infarction, target lesion revascularization, cardiovascular death was significantly low in the drug eluting stents group than in the bare metal stents group, but there was a significant increase in the stent thrombosis. The overall outcome of the study proved that Drug eluting stents implantation is safe and effective in the long term for the treatment of left main coronary artery disease stenosis compared with bare metal stents implantation.